dear divine souls in this class you are going to learn where is god many people strongly think that god is existing outside that's why in india and abroad many people are going to temples churches and masjids to worship god however i can confidently say that god is alive in the hearts of everyone for how long you will search god outside that long you cannot see the god so by sincerely and effectively you have to travel internally towards your eternal soul then only you will see god easily and quickly if you understand this truth properly no need to go to a temple or masjid or church because your heart has become a unique and tremendous temple here don't misunderstand that i am criticizing temples churches and masjids my intention is you should not limit your worship to praying centers you should also worship the inner god if you have interest you may go to your praying center there is no mistake in that but you should not forget to worship your inner god you cannot see god with your physical eyes because god is beyond physical eyes it is impossible for anybody to see god with physical eyes if you have a strong desire to see god your mind should travel towards god and the mind should merge in the god then only you can see god clearly and easily god is always waiting for you to travel towards him and to unite with him so don't spend more time in worshiping of a statue instead of that spend more time in worshiping of your inner god if you are worshiping a statue with love and attention no need to stop that my advice is spend less time in the worshiping of a statue and spend more time in the worshiping of your inner god according to the message of all grand masters great yogis and several scriptures the god is alive in every particle that's why the veda says isha vashyam idagam sarvam yat kincha jagachyam jagatu which means in every particle god is existing in the form of super consciousness here you may ask a question that if the god is existing in everywhere in every particle then what is the mistake of worshiping a statue as god it is a good question there is no doubt in that but you should clearly understand that you will never see real god in physical things such as statues and idols because god is beyond physical forms so if you want to see god easily and clearly you have to do meditation properly and effectively that's why in india the great grand master 
named Yogi Vemana says that Silano Pratimaje Sichi Katilo Betti Mrokavala Dikano Modhulara Ullamandu Brahma Munduta Teliudi Viswadabhirama Vinurave Ma This great poem is written by Yogi Vimana. It means, why are you molding a stone into a statue of God? And why you are worshipping that statue? The God is alive in your heart. 